Hey you and welcome back to my channel. It's Logan Leslie bringing you another plane with me. As you can see, I've already used last week's planner and so we're gonna be going on to the next week, but I'll be changing it up. So instead of using the typical pages, I'll be using scrapbook paper and you'll see how I incorporate this into my planner. So first what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my planner to the side and I already cut the paper from this large 12 by 12 scrapbook sheet. And how I did this was basically, I took one of these sheets and then I cut the boxes out. So my boxes are already cut. I did that off camera just because I wanna make sure everything is super straight for this spread. What I'm gonna do next is to Okay guys, so what I'm gonna do next is take my Happy Planner punch. This is the big punch. I'm gonna take it and put it in here and line it up, right? Make sure you put it all the way in if you wanna do this at home. And you just punch it. I probably could have done the other sheet as well, but I just wanna make sure everything's right. It can be easy to mess up paper crafts. All right. So now that the pages are punched, look like this inside the disc and since the pages are punched I'm gonna glue down or take down rather these boxes I just have to see where I want them placed so I'm gonna be using a Tombow tape runner it's the permanent adhesive tape runner You want to make sure you tape down all your edges and stuff because they will peel up if you're not like careful with that. You don't need tons of this stuff because it works really well. All right, and I want that to sort of match up with this bottom notch here. But push it over so you can still see the pink behind it. All right, that looks good. Do the other side, flip it over. And I just really wanted to change this week up. My mom had said that my like planner looks kind of the same two weeks in a row. I was like, oh my gosh, no. Like you have to, I have to change it this week and go like super offbeat of what I've been doing the past two weeks. So you won't see a lot of florals in this spread, um, but that's okay. All right. So now that we have this, I actually need to go back into my planner to grab the other t uh, pages from like the week before. So as you can see, this is my one of my pages from the week before. And then I'm gonna take my new page and tape it onto the one side. So you see, I'm covering up the 19th, 20th, and 21st. That's because I'm gonna do it on this page and cover it over. So I'm just gonna take my tape runner and actually I'm gonna tape it on this side. I'm gonna tape, put my long strip. And I'm gonna have to go back in on the side to just make sure it's taped down good. And then you want to match up with your notches on the other page. Thank you. Oh my goodness. It's a little bit harder to do on camera just because you have like your camera and your lighting all in the way. But for you at home, it shouldn't be that hard. And of course, I did not match up the notches. Don't rip. Don't rip. Honestly, I feel like in like a normal spread versus like a custom one like this, it doesn't take that much longer and it always gives you a super nice finish. I'm just gonna cut this excess off the bottom. But this week I have tons and tons and tons of stuff to do. I'm super busy. 
which is always good. Um, I feel like I'm one of those people that's definitely a workaholic and I always want to be busy. Um, I don't know why, but being busy and staying busy feels right for me. Um, and it's funny because I was like, well, I definitely need a break before I start chiropractic school in the fall. But I don't know how much of an actual break it's going to feel like to me because I just, I don't take breaks typically. So you see how everything's good. Like this. And now I pre-selected my stickers so that way it wouldn't take me as long. I know this is just one sticker, but there's plenty to come. Okay. So I pre-selected my stickers for this week. I picked out a lot of different stickers from my different planner books. I honestly don't know all the different books that they're from, but I will make sure in future videos to like, you know, make sure you guys know just in case you want to do that. Maybe I'll start with this Saturday sticker since I want to come up a bit. Yeah, lots of fun plans this week. Um, and with finals coming up soon, it's important to make sure, you know, my plans are in check for school. Oops. Um, yeah. Spring is here, y'all. Gotta have, I can't wait to have, start doing all of, like, my summer spreads. I feel like my summer spreads are my favorite because I always put, like, um, like the pool floaty stickers and drinks and stuff and then well I can't say they're my favorite but I definitely love them a lot um okay Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday okay I'm talking quite a bit but I just gotta make sure like this stuff actually gets done I like I do like filming this for you guys a lot for me it's fun and it's actually keeping me very accountable for my plans. So this is a nice big start sidebar sticker. And oh no. when you start YouTube you think like oh is this gonna be beneficial to me or is it gonna like just get in the way that type of thing but honestly right now I feel like it's benefiting like my mental health and also keeping myself accountable with planning I know it seems like oh well you just decorate your planner and stuff and like maybe you don't use it I use my planner quite a bit and I'm sure my family's tired of me talking about planning and planner crap but it's really helped impact my life and I've done this pretty much four years out of college. And I can say that it's actually really helped me make sure I stay on task with my school assignments. And the weeks that I don't plan, I really suffer in school. So I'm just getting out this first full box. Ooh, I like that. So if you can see the foil on it, it's so cute. I'm sticking stickers to my desk now uh, by accident. All right, so that looks good so far. What am I, oh, I wanted to get that sidebar down. Of course, I'm gonna number this week, but I wanna put the, the days first because sometimes you don't always line up the days correctly. I don't know where my tweezers are that I use for planning. <laughs> If you can see, if you watch my first two videos, I'm also struggling because I'm wanting to use some of my smaller stickers, but I don't have my tweezers. Yeah, that's good. A 
SOS to the tweezers. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But get yourself some tweezers, especially if you have longer nails. Um, it can be helpful. I'm trying to plan. Oh, no, that one's really, really crooked. Of course, when I like try and smooth it out, it picks it up. Also, I just want you like to ask you guys like if you like this style of planning, I can definitely do this each week. But if you like the sped up version, um, yeah, so just let me know which version of planning you like with me. I can do either. Last week I just did the sped up version just so I could get it up for you guys. Um, today I'm actually filming on Saturday so that because I know I'm gonna be busy tomorrow so that way it will be already up on Sunday this whole planning and stuff is you know getting a little not planning but the actual recording and stuff can be a bit much so and editing takes some time as well mm, actually. Yeah. I want to even things out a little bit there we go I love these like girls, they're so cute. Oh, let's go here. I don't know, that's weird. Um, I just wanna trim this because this is like navy blue. It may look black on the camera, but it's not. I gotta have my checklist like pretty much every day because there's so much stuff to get done between studying, shopping, um, Yeah, you guys know what life is like, so. That's pretty much it for a, these little pieces are hard to keep together. It's funny though, because I think most YouTubers can relate to this. I don't like hearing my actual voice. Um it's quite i don't know it's like irritating to me to listen to my own voice editing um because i don't know it, it's a thing typically people don't like hearing their own voices unless i guess they're a narcissist um so. and this is starting to come together I just love like the transformation on like, the pages and stuff. It can really come together quite quickly. And I knew I was gonna put this here, so I'm just gonna boop, pop that right on there. Um, a little progress each day adds up to big results. I need this kind of motivation in my life. Um, sometimes it just feels like with school and stuff, like I'll be graduating within the next couple of weeks, which I'm really excited for. But it just seems like it's such a long time coming. And I'm just like, can we please come on? Like, but I believe Thursday or Friday of this like this upcoming week, I have to go and pick up my cap and gown, which I think is gonna be like a really cool moment for me. Which I'm excited for because you know, graduating and oh no, come here, sticker. Of course, the day I'm like trying to show you guys how I plan is when I mess up the most, but that's okay. No one's perfect, right? Okay, I like that. Oh, it's cute. I'm gonna get down my other checklist. I should have cut these little pieces off before that I didn't like, but. And now I'm getting them everywhere. But I think over time, this YouTube stuff is gonna get, you know, become like second nature. I don't think I'm doing too bad so far, but I mean, everybody always has difference of opinions and stuff. And it's funny because you can see, I wanted to reach for a bunch of flowers and stuff, but I was like, I'm gonna not do that as much because I've been, I feel like I keep doing the flowers. 
recently. And it's funny because I was never really the flower person. I think that's like more my mom's style. But she's probably like, oh, that looks so feminine. It's really cute. And I'm not a big hand drawn person like Lacey is. So I gotta make do with what I got. But I might go back to flowers next week. Probably after seeing some of my sister's pictures uh, of her vacation because of all the wonderful flowers that they're gonna see. I have a bill to pay. I think it might be Monday. Most of my things are on like automatic payment. I just like to know when the money is gonna come out. Um, let's get a to do. We need to start like, so this is like if I have a weekly to do, like something that doesn't have to get done on a specific day, but it needs to get done by the end of the week. Wild at heart, yes I am. No, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'm truly wild at heart. I'm pretty consistent with a lot of things in my life, but let's put it down. Ooh, this one's crooked. Y'all, I wish you were here to say like, Logan, well, get it together. That one's crooked, real crooked. I'm glad I caught it. But a crooked sticker should not, you know, should not deter you. Um, I think my mom wants to actually start planning pretty regularly. So if you see me with an extra player on here, it's my mom's. Oop, I was missing a checklist. Actually, go back to find one or two of those hearts. There we go. Think of the box. A lot of people layer their boxes like on a piece of wax paper and then they um, transcribe them. Me, I just do it this way because it's easier. Um, I think I'll actually take the full box from this. So this is like, oops, this is the Happy Planner Punch classic size. And you can just take any slice of paper that you like. You can take any slice of paper you like. And Put it in here, punch, and if you can keep this window closed, it should stay in there. Maybe one more. I really want the marbling of it. Okay. This one's the prettiest to me. And I think I'm gonna put it. No, I think that's a little much. Should have thought about putting this down beforehand. Maybe I'll cut it. This is a half box, so that's what that's gonna be. You know, I'll just cover up this black strip because I don't need it to have a lot of on every little thing. I just try this on top. I think I want a little corny coat. This one's a little shiny, but it says every minute you spend wishing you had someone else's life is a minute spent wasting yours, which is so true. All right. I think I'm going to go back to see if I can find some more of these like cute girls to put around. 
and I think that's gonna be it. All right, so guys, I went back and I found me a couple other girls. Typically, I don't mix the two types of girls because this one, obviously she looks like literally it could be, almost be a picture and she's like a little bit more cartoonish, but if I think, if I separate them a little bit and I put her like over here, now I wish I had a, eh, no, it's okay. Put her like there. I also found some little sunglasses to sprinkle throughout. Also, if you hear like snorting, it's not me. It's my nephew pup, Bubba. He's here while my sister is visiting Hawaii. And I don't mind him because he, he doesn't really bark too much and isn't bad. And I found some more hearts. I'm just gonna sprinkle throughout the page. All right, so I'm just gonna put this sticker down too. I wanted this sticker to be like really, I mean, <laughs> this spread to be really full. This one says welcome spring. Okay, we're actually gonna put it in the bottom corner. There we go. And I'm gonna take down this box right up here. Oops. All right, so that's my plan for this week. It also reminds me, if you're not following me yet on my Inst my planner Instagram, it is Logan's underscore planner um, for all of your planner needs. I post there um, and I also post reminders about my videos and stuff. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more plan with me's in the future. I post them every Sunday or Monday, depending on how my week goes. All right, bye guys, and thanks for watching.